One of tonight's big games is Park Hill and Lee Summit West. KCTV5's Nathan Vickers is there to explain what's being done to keep people safe. Nathan. Ellen, tonight is actually senior night at Park Hill, and I want you to look over here to see what all is going on. They're getting ready to honor some of the upperclassmen on the football team, on the cheer squad, and in the band. And normally this would be one of the biggest events of the season, and it would be later in the season. It would draw a giant crowd. Right now, though, the school is restricting tickets to two per player, and tonight seniors get an extra two tickets for their families and friends. They're expecting around 300 people, and they've marked where they can sit in the stands to stay socially distant. They also put up a live stream so people could watch from home. The boosters moved up senior night to this week just in case some of the later games this season were canceled. Park Hill's principal says the coaches and players know they have to follow the rules and keep each other healthy for football to continue through the fall. And we did all the precautions we needed to do to be sure that we'd have the fans and the athletes safe. And so the athletes have taken a lot of time and effort to get ready for this evening's game. And unlike always before, part of that effort is to make sure they stay masked up, they stayed six feet apart, social distancing all the time in practice so that we would know that we could count on them to do what was right and necessary to make the game come off. Yeah, and in addition to the live stream of the game, their marching band has also pre-recorded their halftime performance, and the school's going to broadcast that online as well. Reporting live in Park Hill, Nathan Vickers, KCTV 5 News. Thank you, Nathan.